Welcome to Alexa's Tech Room. Sounds good. Spur Audio 12 412 800 Max Power Dual 4 Ohm Shallow Mount Car Subwoofer. The aforementioned item is sold by Skr Audio. Product linked in the description below. 12 inch dual 4 ohm shallow mount subwoofer. Peak power 800 watts RMS power 500 watts. Shallow mount design mounting depth 4. 92. High performance pressed paper cone stitched to premium foam surround. Sensitivity 85. 9. Thurs 36. 6. Frequency response 25 is 300. 4.5 out of 5 stars. The item has a total of 381 reviews. Product linked in the description below. The first review is from Dakotago Zone. Sounds good. 5.0 out of 5 stars. Sounds good and loud. I still haven't turned them up all the way. This review is from Xanaforial. Great subs, great price. 5.0 out of 5 stars. Love these subs. Look and sound great and hit like champs. Everything arrived well packaged and undamaged. Replaced two kicker comp subs that I've had for a while but tried to repropose for a new setup. Got these for my 2016 GMC Super Crew and put them in a sound box sealed enclosure and they sound amazing. Running a 1000 in JL amplifier, turned way down right now, but will add to review when I tune the subs later this week. This review is from Michael. No issues, great sound. 5.0 out of 5 stars. I will say that I was skeptical purchasing this woofer about a year ago as I did not know of the manufacturer. If you're looking for a woofer that has value, I recommend this one. I've owned the 812 for about a year now placed in an older sealed box and hooked up to a discontinued Pioneer amp. I've had no issues with it, great sound output, but I will be ordering the ported prefab box Spur makes after doing some research on that as well as a cleaner look in the trunk since the older sealed box was bought from a pawn shop. I've pushed this thing to its limit and a little past that after break-in period and held up fabulous. Best woofer I've owned. This review is from McShan. It has great sound. 5.0 out of 5 stars. I have it in Munich Corvette and it sounds great. This review is from Falcon's Crest. Kick ass. 5.0 out of 5 stars. Best sounding sub if owned out of Alpine Kicker. Finally got my custom under seat. 5 which is underrated at 450 tau into 2 ohms rooms only number that matters. This sub can take a lot more. I recommend the amp too. Oh did I mention cheap. Beautiful. The only negative is this is an extremely shallow sub. Be aware of it's still over 5 deep and the basket is wide. I messed up and placed my hole about 34 too far back and can't install the sub square to box. Basket is probably about 85 degrees, with respect to minting flang for about 212. 9. Koofed fiberglass sealed box structurally completed. Push terminals will barely fit 210 or if you run coils in parallel. 12. Gauge no problem. Ram 1500 quad cab 3rd gen added a little dynamite and polyfill. I put on three kinds of bass. Wow. Music sounds very natural. Cleaner than any other sub I've owned. Smooth and tight, no tensile lead noise. I'm running off of a Skursk 900. This review is from George L. Hard hitting bass for an unbelievable price. 5.0 out of 5 stars. These speakers were used to replace the 12 RT kickers in my 2017 Roush Phone 150. After about four years, the kicker's finially blue, and I need an inexpensive replacement. It is what I have. These Stuver 12 speakers hit hard. Just as hard or maybe harder than the kickers. Initially, I was a little skeptical because I am not familiar with the brand name. I read an Amazon review and price of under 100 each convinced me to try them. I thought it would not be much of a loss if I blew these also. 
I was completely and pleasantly surprised at the sound quality, volume, and pressure. You will feel bass these speakers produce with a good in Sabox. I recommend a ported Sabox. This review is from Luis E. Flores de La Cruz. Soon in Mubin. 5.0 out of 5 stars. This review is from Emil. Try it out. 4.0 out of 5 stars. Had this for just over a week, very happy. Using it as a home theater subwoofer. And the bass is awesome. And at 75, too much, but love it. Great product. This review is from Robert. Impressive. 5.0 out of 5 stars. Have been a diehard Fosgate fan for 30 years. Purchased this because the dimensions fit in a Takatoons box. I can see why they are quickly becoming popular. At only 5. 5Q I was worried the sound would suffer from a 12, so I got this because of the price. This thing pounds. Cannot believe I'm getting that much bass from a shallow 12 in a 5. 5 box. I hate to admit it, but a Fosgate shallow doze would come close. I'm going to buy a full size and build a Tospic ported box just to see what these can do. These are beefy subs. This review is from Charleston Selman. Best budget sub. 5.0 out of 5 stars. Has good power handling capability. Nice sub range. Isn't quite a super heavy thumper, but sounds very good. Good budget sub. Our first question is from Aaron. Would this fit in the dual electronics 1204 12 inch bandpass subwoofer box? That dual subwoofer box comes preloaded with dual 12 subs. I won't buy that box. I have one professionally built to meet the sub's requirements. Question from Corey. Is this unit easy to use? Put unit. Question from Addison. Should I get the 2 ohm or 4 ohm 12 shallow mounts? I'm getting be putting them in a ported box. And will be running 1000 watts per amp. It depends on the ohm load your amp can take. If your amp does 16,001 ohm, then two dual 4 ohms can be wired to one. If your amp does 16,001 ohm, then two dual 4 ohms can be wired to one. I would highly suggest you watch a few videos from Sonus Electronics on YouTube to understand ohm loads. One or the other does not make a speaker sound better correct ohm load box, and gain matching makes a speaker sound good. See less? If your amp cannot handle a 1 ohm load, then you go to dual 2 ohm to wire to a 2 ohm load. If your amp cannot handle a 1 ohm load, then you go to dual 2 ohm to wire to a 2 ohm load. The more speakers, the more your power is divided. The more speakers, the more your power is divided. An amp that will do 800 1 ohm will give you 400 per speaker. An amp that will do 800 1 ohm will give you 400 per speaker. IWC more, it depends on the ohm load your amp can take. Question from Corey. I need shipping to Chile. No. Question from Pinch Beto. So I can wire the forearm down to an ohm stable amp. If you have two DVC forearm subs, you can wire the pair in parallel, which will bring the final impedance to one ohm. Just make sure you find a good amp that's one ohm stable. Question from Urban Boy. Does two of these hit hard at own ohm? I have mine wired at twums each around 500 watts rooms. They hit hard if, just by the two if you're going to wire down to own ohm. Question from Xtoys. What type of amp would best work with this single 12 forearm? I have a Jewel Kix 500 on my dual 4 ohm wired to 2 ohm. I stuffed it into an old kicker comp box, and it's incredible, so incredible. I am buying another old kicker box, and another Skirvton, and a 1 ohm stable amp. Question from Corey. I have enclosure box for 212 mounting depth 7. 5. Volume 1. 2 cool. Per chamber. Camber box separated chambers. And I need the bees woofer. Stir shallow mounted 12s. Question from Billy Keith Reed II. Is this a pair or one sub? One sub. Question from Jeremy S. Will this fit under the seat of a 2016 Silverado? Yeah, I would think so. If got two in a box, 
in a 2015 2500 under the back seat. Product linked in the description below. For more content like this, please subscribe and click the bell icon so you are notified of new uploads. We upload new videos every day. See you next time.